guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes 19, 20, and 21 of season 3 of Bakuman. So it's going to get started with episode 19 and 3, 2, 1, Autumn, and 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> oh god, somebody is a little overconfident, huh? Oh, that's smart. Ah. Probably so, but yeah. First might, yeah, but after that it should be easy for you guys. No, please don't. Because seriously, we don't need Machino to like freaking... <laughs> Again, no, no. But the first time, like, that hurt. And such, like, how I can't even imagine, like, okay. So, I literally just got off of work. But by the time Patreons will see this, I should be at work for Saturday. Um, and then by the time everybody else sees this, um, I should be off. Um, so, because it's Thursday. I am tired. I literally got home, like, an hour ago. I ate my lunch slash early dinner and it was good so good and I was like oh, I, I was like I'm tired I'm kind of ready to just take a shower and go to bed but I was like wait I gotta record this and then tomorrow on Friday before I go to work I'm gonna try to record banner and if I can't record it before I go to work I'm gonna record it after I get home and get that shit out so that Patreon's gonna have that out for Saturday but it was very tiring. I think it kind of went a lot faster now that this is only day three for me. And I kind of know the ins and the outs. There's some things that I'm still struggling a little bit and such. But in a way, I kind of took over today. And I think I felt, I felt really badass by the end of the day. I, I'm just, I'm proud of myself. Very, very proud of myself. <laughs> Are we cleaning? He's right. Seriously?
<laughs> Somebody's a little jealous. But why didn't you say anything, He's literally going to work himself to the bone again. Look how tired he looks. Seriously? God damn, five energy drinks? Well, four and then coffee. It's just about getting it the fuck done. Excuse me. Excuse me.
my god, Machido, please get some rest. Jesus. Hmm? Is it Azuki? Oh! Kitchen in the bathroom. Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I would say, hey, somebody could just sit out in the terrace on the deck, you know, on the porch. But if it gets windy, psh, that's it. <laughs> Good. Mm, it is good. Oh, oh. So. I love how we're featuring Azuki in the eye catch, possibly indicating she might be in this episode, but who knows? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I almost choked, but okay.
Okay. Of course. So, of course, he killed him off just to have make a better one. Well, yeah, I mean, that's the typical bottom manga, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 
if you have to, you do what you got to do. That's right. <laughs> Do you want to make it longer? Okay, you don't have to if you don't want to. I think you could. Let's hope and pray. This, 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 uh, I cannot speak. Oh my god. This goes good for them. Oh my god. But yes. How I like the fact that you know us. Like he got like a little teeny tiny little baby moment in today's episode. But like uh And then Kaya. Oh my god. Because you know after the last situation with Kaya and <clears throat> Akito and, and you know their little argument because of course, Shuji pissed me the fuck off because, of course, it gave me hella death note feels when freaking light went off on Misa. And I was like, well, god damn it. Like, oh, okay, like, yes, I love you, but she ain't gonna go off on her. Like, damn. Shit, what the fuck is wrong with you? I don't know, because see, here, here's the funny thing. Like, I, when I was rewatching Death Note for the first, uh, like, the first, uh, for the first time in, like, forever, and I was watching with my mom because it was my mom's first time as well. Um, we got to that part, and I went off, and I was like, God, I hate this motherfucker. I was like, I love him. I love him to death, but I hate him. I was like, come on, man, you don't respect anyone but your fucking self. You don't give a shit about any of these fucking women, you fucking asshole. I was like, Jesus Christ. I was like, oh, God. Oh, but like, yes. I hope this works out for them. I mean, I understand what the fact is, you know, when you're looking at a manga and you really, when you're comparing it to someone else's and you're like, damn, should this possibly be, you know, a long running series with like, <laughs> how long is fucking One Piece? Like 1,000 episodes as of now? Hell, I think Detective Conan is somewhat up there. I think Detective Conan is like in its 
600 or 700 episodes and such. And especially with someone who really loves the shit out of Detective Conan and sometimes I'm like, when the fuck is this series gonna end? Like, that series has been, I think both One Piece and Detective Conan have been, like, since the 90s. So, like, I was born in 93, so they had to be, like, in the early, early 90s. So, of course, both those damn series are older than me. And I'm like, bro, y'all ain't done yet. Like, what else can you tell? I understand the 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 situation of making like a really long lasting series, but when you look at like other mangakas in you know past and present, and specifically like let's say, and we hope and pray that this never happens for these two um, mangaka artists that someone passes away, like the person who created a series passed away. And it just abruptly ends at, like, part one of two or part two of three. And we don't really get that quote-unquote conclusion. Like, how is um, the company that the anime is doing it for, how are they supposed to continue that and such? There was a time where, like, I think when I was in early, early either elementary school or middle school, when Adult Swim was still airing Case Clothes, like, or Detective Conan, what it's called in Japan, um, on Adult Swim, and they would air it at, like, 3 in the morning, and so there was a time where I kind of thought that the show kind of just ended abruptly, wherever the hell that they ended it, because, you know, Funimation had the rights for it up until a certain point, and then they lost the right, and now it's... Kind of, the anime rights for it is kind of like up in the air somewhere. I don't really know who officially has the rights, but I know like I'm praying deep in my heart that like somebody could redub it, um, or just release it strictly in Japanese or give it an English release, but just in Japanese and such. Um, but like I said, there was a time where I thought like one random day, maybe when I was in middle school as well, when I thought it ended because of course Funimation took, um, not Funimation, Adult Swim took it off the air and such and I never really saw it again. So I was like, well, this just ends at this episode right here. But when I found out that there was more that got dubbed, I was like, oh, and then the dubs just never continued, so of course you had to watch the rest of it in Japanese, which is I am okay with, like, thank God. But yes, I mean, this is kind of like the same thing of the ending for, um, of course, their other series, Platinum Zen. I, I know the ending. I have not seen, you know, the ending for the anime and such because I think they just started the second half of the show and such, but I mean, if you've read that manga, we all know how this is going to end and such. You just kind of want to see it John, like in anime form and so anytime when I think of that ending I always think about how many people who are kind of like for that ending or they're against that ending because the story of Platinum Zen is such like a really nice strong interesting premise but it's weak because of that ending and such and so when you look at something like Bakuman or Death Note and how those two like well I can't I can't say anything for Bakuman yet because we're not really done with it but how specifically with Death Note it has like a strong begin uh, beginning middle and end and such and with Bakuman I have a strong beginning a strong middle and I'm wondering how this is going to end if it's going to be strong and you look at Platinum Zen which is like oh it's good but then that and then like mm, it's just I understand with certain mangas where they're like, when they know when they want to end something, they can just end it. They, yes, they might get a lot of heat from fans, maybe even the companies like Jump or whoever they're a part of for, you know, doing this and such. Maybe even from fans, friends and family and everything, but it's their masterpiece. You end it when you want to end it, not when somebody else is forcing you to end it or something. Because... That's kind of really what happened with one of my personal favorite mangakas. I ain't gonna say who he is, but you know, um, hint, hint, his, um, his show is finally getting the, you know, Anna, the last little arc coming out in fall of this year, and your girl is fucking excited for it so she can see her husband again. But yes, go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 20. Okay, episode 20 in three, two, one, go. Well, damn, I'm thirsty.
But the hills are alive, really. Baby. <laughs> I 
I mean, it's cute. It's subtle. Mm-hmm. I forgot how much I love that outfit. I mean, come on. This is King Arthur we're talking about. This is also Lafayette we're talking about as well. I don't think she's going to say no to him. She really likes him. Come on now. I mean, he you know is adorable. Like, come on. What's not to like about him? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want some of snack on. Do I still have my bag? No, my bag is all the way the fuck over there. Do you not have the- OH MY FUCKING GOD!
It's something about guys and like white tux are just so freaking good. Come on. My neighbors probably hate me. <laughs> but like this damn bitch. Please don't. You don't want to die after you just got proposed.
Maybe because it's more interesting. No one. Maybe. Yeah, like a non filler. Well, yeah, filler type thing. Like a chill episode, basically. Well, come on. It's Christmas. Even though it's January. It's Christmas. It wouldn't surprise me if, like, Alki is there. I say Alki, Azuki, wrong person. So many freaking names in my mind right now.
<laughs> oh my god! Even though, you know, it didn't say the whole word animation. Half of it was covered by his hands, but ah! Shut up! Ah! We win it today, boys! Let's go! Oh my god! Oh! Stop it when you know you just fucking know! Like, oh shit! Yes, let's go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Like, come on now, damn it. Oh, everybody won today. Mm-hmm. I won. You won. We all fucking won today, damn it. Mm-hmm. This is our fucking year. Like, oh. We're kicking eyes and we're taking names. Like, oh, this could be really good. I wonder what it's going to look like. Like, oh. God, see, that's the one thing I love when, like, a really good manga is good anime adaptations and stuff, and you're super excited for it and everything. But the biggest thing is you're always wondering, like, what that first look is going to be. Like, okay, there's so many people so fucking excited for Chainsaw Man, even though I've never really, like, read it and such. I don't know if I'm going to watch it when it comes. Um, but from what I had saw from the preview about, like... When did I see that preview? Last month? Or my birthday? It, ha it had to be between October 18th, my birthday, to kind of December. Whenever that first trailer came out, or like one, one of the many trailers that came out for it, because it was that big MAPPA anniversary trailer that came out one. Then they showed, like, I think a PV for it. So that was the second trailer I saw. I don't know when that one came out. Whenever the hell that one came out. And so, I mean, that's one of those shows where, like I said, I don't know if I'm going to watch it yet. Like, it looks very, very interesting and such. But at the same time, I'm like, I'm over here like, <laughs> we'll see. But, I mean, this could really be good for my boys. My boys are possibly going to get their manga as an anime. And then Asuki can audition for it. And then we're done. Like, oh, we could just end the show. I love the fact that, like, somebody, a newer, a rookie voice actress came into this episode just for, like, a couple minutes. She had, like, number one for 100%. She looked like fucking Risa from Persona 5. And I was like, oh, my God, I already love her. Like, best girl-ish. Because, of course, Risa was my best girl in Persona 5 when I put Persona 5 Persona 4 wrong game Persona 5 it was on in Haru and Persona 3 it was Akari Akari y no Yukari Yukari there we go mm -hmm. yes yes mm -hmm. yes so seeing like a little tidbit of maybe little hint hint to Persona 4 up in here was very nice I mean mm, but if if, if, 
if, if this is what I think it is, which is very obvious that it is, like, that's it, like, go ahead, throw it in the bag, we fucking won, like, let's go, bitches, like, psh. Oh, I <laughs> let it be a win for this last episode until the last two, the last four episodes I have to watch next week. But go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for episode twenty-one. Alrighty, episode twenty-one and three, two, one, go. BTW, I'm about to eat some pistachios right now because I'm hungry. So. Go get yourself something to eat, you know, because I know I'm probably going to make you hungry, especially if you're hearing stuff in the background. <laughs> so, um, yeah! <laughs> I know, I want to cry! But gosh, if you're hungry, please go get food. I don't want to be recording and you watch this. Patreons, I'm talking to you on a Saturday. Everybody else, I'm talking to y'all. And I don't want to be <laughs> right here by myself. Pre-recorded DJ eating, patro <laughs> eating Patreons, eating pistachios at 8.53 at night. And then someone's like, damn, I'm hungry now. Thanks, DJ. I'm like, I'm sorry. But like I told you to go get something to eat. <laughs> Cause it was worse. I remember one time, um I ate grapes. Cause I was craving grapes. And I think I was watching Overlord. And somebody was like, You made me want grapes, so I went in my kitchen and I <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. I was like, my bad, though. I was like, but hey, at least you were hungry. So, why don't you take a break? You really want him to third wheel, y'all? Y'all really want that. Kaya really want that. Right? Then you wouldn't start wheeling. A company trip. Okay. If you say so. I was about to say. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, come on! Mm. Well, at least it's your first hangover. Are you going to drunk text? Baby, too drunk. He's so drunk. Oh, baby. Cody, I'm not giving you my pistachios. You can't have any. Cody, I'm not giving you my pistachios. Leave me alone. Really? 
True. Yes. Oh my gosh. No way. It's a damned if you do, damned if you don't situation. Exactly. So you have to say yes. But the <laughs> Mashido <Mashiro> struck us. <laughs> Possibly, yes.
Exactly. Yes, but this, once again, damned if you do, damned if you don't. I pulled oranges. It's like, I can't, I can't, I can't. You might as well tell him. We only got four more episodes left, so you might as well just do it. Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> yeah, but I'm just wanting some wins that. Oh, hey, reverse is gonna get something. Hey! hey. Mm.
Oh. Hey, big boy. Like around the fall, like damn. What else are you supposed to do? Huh. Please. So just let them both at the same time. Yep. Well, oh God. You bitch! You would do that! You would fucking do that! You would fucking do that! You would fucking do that shit! Why the fuck would you do that? Why would you do that? Like, come on now. We only have four more episodes left. And you could have given me something. Oh my god. You could have gave me something. You gave me a cliffhanger. You know, I thought Attack on Titan pissed me off with cliffhangers. Well, yeah, it still does. It still truly does. I think we all know Attack on Titan pisses me off with the fucking cliffhangers. But this cliffhanger? Fuck it. <laughs> like, oh my god. Mm, god, no. It's bullshit. Bullshit. But by the time I watch the next two episodes, it should be Saturday for me. Because my goal is to try to watch... 20 22 and 23 on saturday and then the final two episodes next wednesday when i have a day off and stuff but okay if they get the anime adaptation once again they won they fucking won but because of the way this episode ends abruptly, we're not getting that answer until I watch the next two episodes. But I'm so excited. I really need them to win because we, you know, we just want Asuki and Bachi to get married by the end of this damn show, please. I just want a happy ending next week. Please, please, please. Hell, I may even watch the last four all in one day. It just depends on, like, I, I get home at, at one. I have my dress-up darling. So, yeah, like, by the time y'all see this, this is probably when I come home. Probably gonna watch my dress-up darling. And that one other show from this season that is currently airing about sailor uniforms. Because everyone is saying, oh, this is good, DJ. You would like this. I'm like, okay. So, I, I might end up watching, like, the first two episodes tomorrow, aka Friday, between Banner and, um, Slow Loop, so that I can have it come out on Saturday, and then I don't have to, like, stress. Because <laughs> stress is my middle name! <laughs> Not really, but, you know. Um, but yeah, I love the fact that the next episode is a Miho. 
episode because of course like yes we need that in my life like yes Saudi how you mean back in my life like always because you know this week was a good week for me as a Saudi how you mean fan because oof baby came home as Kate this week and I cried my ass off and then everything else about like really some good things about what I heard heard about her and her career and stuff but like guys this has been a really awesome fucking week even though it ain't done yet um but I just need these boys to get this adaptation. Do I feel like we're going to get the answer in maybe, like, the next two episodes? Probably not. Maybe the final two episodes of this show, once I compare from episode one to the beginning of the show and stuff. But I really, one thing I do want to say is, and this is me as someone who, oh, of course, once again, loves the shit out of Death Note and such, and just... Finally, after years, fucking years, finally bought the damn series on Blu-ray for like 15 bucks at Walmart. Um, with this, it makes you kind of wonder why this never had an English release. Like, the only thing for this is the manga. And it makes you wonder why only the manga really got to have like a worldwide release. And this, the anime, didn't get the same, like, ish that Death Note got. Death Note got a dub. This does not have a dub. Platinum Zen also has a dub, but that's because the deal of Funimation with um, whoever the freak Funimation has that deal with and such. So, of course, whatever Funimation ends up getting, that automatically gets a deal with them. But at the time of when this came out, this had to be like 2012, 2013, I believe. Um, somebody had to have the fucking rights to for this to get dubbed. Was it because it's 75 episodes and nobody felt like dubbing it or such? Or was it because of the higher-ups and, you know, for that company in Japan possibly not wanting to give the rights to an English company and stuff? There's a lot of unanswered questions with that and such. And, you know, I kind of, you know, kind of would love to see an anime on that in a weird way. I don't know why. I mean, it, it, between that and that one other show, I think it's called Q, that is specifically airing this month. It's supposed to be about, like, a little more into the world of voice acting. I think there was something else somebody wanted me to watch that was very similar to like a voice acting thing, but I can't remember the name. No, yeah, can't remember the name, even thinking about it for a moment. But yes, other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episodes 19 to 21 of season 3 of Bakuman. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel, I make videos every single day, join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for Patreons, and next Wednesday for everybody else, and then the following week for the final two episodes. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.